Hi, Nima. What even is this place? It smells terrible. You been paying attention to the old timer? This is Flotsam Vale, kiddo. I'm a shelf is Corpse uh, Company Town. Most of its workers head home here when they ain't scavenging over in Scuttleport. Shelfis Core? So, Roland owns this place? It looks terrible. I thought that guy was, like, good at business. He's great at it, kiddo. This is exactly what good business looks like. Take it in. So if you wanted to know why keeping bottom feeders afloat is so darn important to me, it's because this is the best alternative. For me and my youngins. Been there before and I ain't going back. Well, just don't go crazy. Why has he got feet? Not enough that it's gross. Now it has feet. Gross feet. And they're tough. Surprisingly so. Doesn't look like it. Oh no, it's too slippery. I ain't gonna make it. I tried. I think I need to find one of the increase amount healed items. That probably exists somewhere. Now what I should do the next time I have money instead of buying a bunch of shells for no good reason is increase the amount of uh, passengers I can have by like an obscene amount because those are actually really useful. They directly increase my stats. And make it to where I can do things like not die. Umami is supposed to be the good thing. It's really weird that these corrupted creatures keep having it. Something doesn't quite fit. You don't want to do this. Think about it. another puzzle piece, or a uh, Lego. Or whatever non-copyright term they call them in this game. Legal brick. <laughs> Just a straight up boxing glove. Just a straight up boxing glove. Its ability is squash. But what if I just put it on the end of my fork so I can punch people with it? Yep. Oh, you're gross and in the way. Come here. Come on! Bite me on land. Don't get stuck. You have the pink eyes, so I need to actually kill you. Uh, gunky. Ah! 
Come here. Yeah. I do not like this enemy. <laughs> For many reasons. Chief among them. Doesn't die. good except when it's too goddamn slow. <laughs> what the fuck? I don't care for cowboys standardly, now that guy's underground and no clipping at me. That's just... obscene. Should have stayed hidden. <laughs> that was the repose damage, by the way. As unimpressive as it was. Cowfish boy. Just gonna scuttle by without saying howdy. Ugh. Ouch. These are a very annoying enemy. <laughs> They're surrounded by gunk and their attack sends you flying. Meaning it's not even them that are the problem. It's the environment. Shotgun shell. Later. I read up on what certain shell abilities were. Bombs away is... Sit it there, and then they will explode. <laughs> that leads back to there. That's the path I came from. I haven't gone to the cave, and I haven't been there. You actually want hours oh, tonight. Greetings. You survive, fellow vagabond. Currents run thick with agony here. Lots of evil creatures greed. And since you've seen the light and come to vanquish that evil with me? Well, you sent wrong. I'm still just here looking for the treasure. Treasure. Again with this prattle. Surely no treasure can be more valuable than the rush of adrenaline from taking blade and claw. To be honest, I have no idea what the treasure is. 
but the old guy said it's really valuable and I think it's the only thing the shrimp will accept in exchange for my shell. I don't want to fight evil with you, I just want to go back to the tide pool. A pity. That's that it seems the uh, force controlling his actions is willing to fight evil. If you're not going to attack, then I will. Can't bring that down. There is this path over here. Just supposed to pretend this doesn't exist then. Alright. I guess I'll get that crystal later. Into the cave with the magical no clipping cowboys. Indeed. If half. Do not like them. Stab the duck. Good. Get poisoned. This feels like a bonus thing. And it was. It's fine. I ain't gonna make it out of this. Never mind. I'm not going to make it out of this. Uh, how do I... Oh, that one's actually a pit. Crap. That's not good. That's a long way away. I was out of healing items anyway. That's actually important. Good to know that those could be blue items. Let me go. Maniac. There's a thing at that. Indeed. Hopefully I can get back my stuff without too much of a hassle. It may be in a very bad spot. 
At least you're not stuck in the ground this time. By that I mean I can whack you to death. Double well. Damn it. Well, this is perplexing. How are you supposed to leave this area? Thanks. Making things real easy. Just a... I see now. It's not a hole the entire way across. Yeah, the, those guys are the worst. I don't know what was previously the worst, but they've they've been dethroned. This AOE spamming, slowing, poisoning thing is... No, thank you. Get him soda can. That goes very light. Tax faster. Equivalency. Paper claw. assume that whatever's glowing down there is not a thing I'm supposed to be jumping toward. Oh. Back to this place. You mind? Increase the fish hooks that I don't use. Excellent. Weird, I could have technically gotten here from this way first.
Did I just not rest? I made the shell and then ran off. I believe it. Not a cave. Tissue box. Called a tissue box. It's filled with a different crab. It now has to die. <laughs> sure, why not? Hit him with a tissue box. No. I should hit them like once or twice of a shotgun shell. That'll teach them. Anybody else want to come up say hi? Alright then. I will be ignoring anglerfish. You are not worth it. Hi there, executioner man. Nice to see you alive and well. Though I will know I have killed you before, and I will do it again if I must. I feel like I must. Didn't do quite what you wanted, did it? Dixie Cup, very good. You enter that little wear it on your head mode, and then you can just kind of go. <laughs> Sure, it may not last that long or block that many hits, but it's enough. Let's go the other way first. It just feels more appropriate. Let's 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 use not the hammer for a little bit. See if I need to or not. I kind of don't like that I'm not staggering them, I'll be honest. Well, crap. Dixie Cup is just a really good hammer. I kinda wish I knew why. Sea Cucumber. It's <laughs> What? Sea Why is it so good? Because it costs six things.
which kind of invalidates the previous goodness. Only kind of, though. Still, ways are a good thing in this game for some reason. So you want as many strange creatures feeding off of you in your shell as possible. Salt shaker. That one actually might not be all that bad for defense because it's got metal on the top. But it's still only a tin. It will be destroyed immediately. I saw that. Yeah, I don't know which way to go. Can't move around. I think I saw a switch. Somebody willing to talk, but I don't know how to get up there. Probably through the shortcut I just unlocked. That's what I would assume. You're a horrible monster fish and nobody likes you! Somebody's rigged up the neon. Just a normal enemy now, huh? Pretty happy with my skills and abilities right now. Do not think I need to reset her. I'm one hitting things and I'm not dying. What more could you ask for? Cardboard box. I guess I might need to stealth. It's a prawn stuck in a prawn. Hey. Hey, man. Over look like an honest crap. Think you can help a guy out? I'm in a little bit of a life-threatening predicament. <laughs> I don't know, man. That glass looks pretty tough. Even with this fork, I don't know if I can break it. Okay, well, if you find a better weapon, or if you stop being, like, super weak, maybe come back and free me. I really appreciate it. Thanks, Pip. Probably only, like, two or three times away from starving to death. I'm glad I can help. I don't usually do this, but you look like the kind of guy who can keep a secret. I know a big one. That's okay, you don't have to. You know that big ass crab in the sands between between you know that big ass crab in the sands between who eats everything he finds, right? Yeah, I killed that guy. Whoops. Well then, I got enough for you besides some words of encouragement. You can do it. <laughs> have a great day. <laughs> Please do not underestimate the sheer violence in my heart. 
This cardboard box is so much durability. And this is even more. Guess I'll just tank things. I wonder what the secret was. I mean, I downed him because I knew I could, honestly. I'm not going to be threatened by a big giant monster thing if I can just kill it. Bonk. That did the. That worked. That's not great. Ah, I need a healing item. <laughs> There's too much poison in this area. Hmm. Guess I'll just go as far as I can. And then probably die. Embarrassingly, to poison damage. God damn it. <laughs> Come on. Come on! You added the gunk. No! Fish, I can do this. Salt shaker, mason jar. Oyster. <laughs> Me to the hop. Hi there. Once more, come on. He looks important. Well, if you all insist on announcing your presence and doing a flourish before actually doing anything... Well, that's gonna happen every time. Killing your audience, big guy. You look kinda gladiator-esque with that thing on your head. Wow, you're still alive.
next. I have been Sans healing item for entirely too long. Thank you. Ouch. What? Ouch. What? No. This. <laughs> That's enough. Give me that. Could always just equip another nail after all, why shouldn't I? That guy that can talk over there hasn't uh, friends with anything that I've had to run through. They were at the time out of their minds, I assure you. Spring. Spring. Solo cup is still hanging in there. Kind of impressive. Now I saw a moon snail shell over there. I think I can get to it this way. I need what? We'll get there in a minute, buddy. And by that I mean me, because you're probably off your rocker. Just want to get the respawn point, then I will fight Krabulon. What's up, toilet paper man? Behold the slurry. Somewhere beyond it lies our lost holy land. Perhaps one day I'll venture there myself. But best not to dwell on such things. had no healing items and entirely too many plastics for too long. <laughs> I need to fix this. <laughs> Better. Not too worried about getting a... Uh, up, 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 up. Umami upgrades right now, primarily because, uh, well, I have a bad tendency not to hide in the shell and just die, and the only other things are for the shell. Well, no, I guess that's not true at all, is it? There's a backdash. Which I can probably afford by now. Regardless, first it is Krabulon. They are all Krabulon. Until they give me an enemy that isn't a crab. Those ones are not crab. I feel like this guy should have a boss thing. Scuttling Sledge Steamroll. Yeah. You gonna tell me he was gonna talk to me beforehand? I don't think so. He's 
literally leaking sludge. worse than I thought. He's playing Spatoon. <laughs> I'd say I expected more, but I didn't. The solo cup stays! <laughs> Specimen so tiny that it is powerless against the ocean's currents, but perhaps it's happier that way. Taking damage regenerates Umami. What's this blue thing? go that way to get there. Which is sort of annoying. Let's... oh no. Oh no. Okay. Let's go this way first. Oh gosh dang it. <laughs> oh there's actually a pit there. Please put me back on the... no! I don't know, I think I may have lost less health by falling than by being gunked. There's this big glowy thing. Probably skill up proper, right? Ah. They're actively not worth my time to deal with. I'm actually not allowed to go this way yet. Fair enough. Alright. See how to get in that mailbox in. Running! Jumping! Excitement? I don't know. <laughs> Even here, there are colorful microplastics. It's probably better if I try to go up. And if I just wander right across. <laughs> Not that I particularly know how to go up. Oh, one must assume it's that big bastard. 
gust of hair thingy over there. Give me a lone angler fish. Nice Rubik's Cube. Light to the working crab pulls at one's heartstrings. I'll just labor to extract fresh trash from the seabed and process it into usable supplies. Like the gorgeous polyethylene dress you see on my gorgeous bod. I always makes you question whether or not it's all worth it. Almost. Place is pretty messed up. You think? Roland knows this place, right? I don't know what you expected. That guy's a jerk. I don't know how I go that far. Don't go off insulting someone just because you're jealous of their business skills. How many company towns have you constructed, huh? Whose side are you on? I thought you were trying to beat Roland to the treasure. Right, Roland might be a visionary, but he's standing in between me and my loot. Gotta keep that in mind. Thanks for keeping me grounded, pal. Ugh. Money people liking other money people. The grossness. Not even because of anything that they did, but because they have it. I'm above the water. It's the first time that's happened since the start of the game. And back immediately into the drink. Well, that's a void of nothingness. At least I probably won't find any fishes up here. My attacks are no faster, though, which is perplexing. Oh. No. <laughs> Microplastics. More. Useless. Uh. Did I miss something? Oh, you prick. Why is there an anglerfish up here? You are not even in the water. Whatever hellish cavern spawns you, return to it. That's a very stuck crab. You alive? seriously think they can clean all this up? The gunk isn't in the water. It's not on the ground. It's in our bodies already. Throats, gills behind our eyes. It's in our goddamn minds. 
Okay, buddy. Uh, you do you. Got a cockle. Five valve mollusk. Native to sandy beaches. More hammer damage. Just passively more hammer damage. How much you cost three? It's too much for me. I really need to increase the amount of stowaways I can have. Just to like 15. As many as I can possibly have. This is unpleasant. <laughs> Anemone plus. Like the other one, but just better. Another crab. Just a crap ton of crabs. Have 15 of them. It's a new person each time, like hell divers. Rest in peace, hell divers. Yeah, I know. They they kind of, sort of, maybe fixed it, but at this point in time, they've been nerfing everything people have been using, and. Then the Sony thing happened. That's out of specifically somebody else saying, hey, go to this. I, uh, I've lost interest, and I feel like a lot of other people have as well. Which is sad, because Helldivers 2 was kind of fun. The Ceviche Sisters. Oh, if you parry bullets, they go right back to the center. Well, I know how I'm doing this, then. Because they can't really hurt my valve. <laughs> I need to work on parrying anyway. So this is good practice. It's the fact that it's after a block instead of before or like initiate it during. It's the opposite of Sekiro in other words. Which is just fucking weird. It messes with my mind. Ah! Are those just a thing that was here? Mimics the pistol shrimp's mighty projectile. Congratulations, now you have gun. <laughs> well, I was really hoping this was the right way. Oh, it was. Never mind. That just kind of screamed optional random boss instead of important guy, like Chopstick Man. Another crab. No. Frag, fragging random holes. <laughs> As a clan, I want that over there. Am I just gonna take this? Nothing weird? Matt beast down! Guess I should go back to do Carcinia and have Conch decipher it. But now that I think about it, aren't I just giving away my information? Whatever. It's not like I'm gonna know where to go next or how to sell. I've been the fastest to the map pieces so far. I can be the first to the treasure too. I'm sure of it. Confidence. Well, 
Well, it seems that I can't go into the next area that I would normally be trying to go to. Unless that place is just suddenly unlocked now, which I doubt. Hooray! Aha, it worked. Alright, Nickel. So let's go back to town. Put this thing on the map. Which... I guess would be piece number two out of three. Still say shiny? Shiny. What? Yes. You just want the mailbox, I guess. Which... Don't know how that's sticking out of the ground here. I guess somewhere got flooded, maybe? It's random fragging holes. So let's turn this in. What's that? Oh, it's two things. No, it's just a can. It just looked oddly like a really round thing wearing a hat. <laughs> With eyeballs, because of the reflection. Sure, why not? Moon snail first. Part of me wants to go back to the other area and just clean it out, but I have a feeling that I might have missed something rather important there, or at least a sub boss or something. Dodge with no directional input. Back dash. The hermit crab's aptitude for moving through the water is usually reserved for finned creatures. The sea appears to be part of this little fellow and he passes through with no resistance. Skill for acrobatics need not be used for evasion alone. In the right creature's class, dexterity can be a tool for aggression. And with the proper skill set, the tiniest and most evasive creatures can become absolutely terrified. The Hermit Crab's enemies should be terrified indeed. Perhaps his allies too should act with care. Nah, the allies are fine. Don't even worry about him, man. I guess... Well, my options are basically... Parry... When I don't have a shell. And... Use Umami things more. But I don't want to use umami things more. I kind of just don't like them. The most fearsome advancement in a predator's abilities is the use of tools. To grow beyond one's own body, to outpace one's physical evolution. Such hunters inspire unimaginable fear in their prey. No, nothing for just randomly increasing my umami. Now I can pull things toward which will also hurt their stamina. Hmm. That's a lot. I specifically have to dodge an attack with that in order to do the thing, or is it not a hammer thing? Because I don't know how to unhammer my hammer. The lower crest to the prawn shop. I don't think I have extra keys. I have so much money. Going to blow it all <laughs> on parasites. <laughs> I will not regret it. Mom says you fought a big buff crab of a sword. 
What was it like? Was it tough? Yeah, I mean, yeah. Oh shit, it went really high really quickly. <laughs> Any that I don't already have that I want? That are under 4,000? Or exactly at 4,000? That'd be fine too. No. Well, darn. I mean... I only have three, it's just they can be more beefy now. That's nigh on useless. Random guy. Sure. Random guy might be useful. <laughs> Oh, I can pet it. Sure, why not, I guess. Uh, 40% charge attack damage. Where's the one that increased hammer? What was that? It was, uh... This. I still have... This one can now be moved to a 2. Uh... Boo, 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 boo. Extra 20% balance damage? Maybe. Or plus 33% attack total. But reduced speed. I quite like speed. Spam is kind of my go to. thing. No! Let me go! Okay. I'm almost certain the fish is freaking useless. Like, I, 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 I guess I'll give it the chance to prove that before I replace it. <laughs> Because otherwise, that's kind of rude. But I just... I'm not feeling it, buddy. <laughs> like, unless you actively distract things. My god, my child, you smell absolutely terrible. Keep been waiting neck deep in natural detritus. Tell me about it, man. Flatsome Vale is completely swamped in gunk. Hope I grab the right thing, because I never want to go back there again. See, things are that bad already. All the more reason to keep up our search, I say. Let's have that map piece. Hopefully I can decipher it quick as Kokapoo. It's a big piece. Oh dear. Just give me the bad news already. You may have heard stories or, God forbid, seen it with your own eyes. The rumors say an absolutely monstrous crab dwells in the sands between. One of a truly prodigious appetite, a beast that never stops consuming. According to the map, your path leads you directly to that monster. Be logical to assume it has devoured the next map piece, I say. It has not. Whatever, I fought tough crabs before, I'm not scared at this point. Should I be? Be as scared as you wish, child, as stated, this is all hearsay. But gird your shell and keep your wits about you. It never hurts to be prepared for the worst, I say. Oh. He did have it. You have the look of victory on your face, I say. Yeah, it was tough, but exciting. See what comes next, I'm kinda stoked. Is this the last piece? It appears so. Unless I'm mistaken, we're all about to learn the treasure's resting place. And my antennae twitch with anticipation. I scarcely believe this. The treasure lies just off the coast of Flotsam Vale, submerged within the slurry. Incredible, we're so close I can taste it. Oh, hey guys. 
Indeed, all that remains is to head to the docks, grab a boat, and then... And then what? Roland. No, please, don't let me interrupt you. Enlighten me as to your intentions. So the treasure's sunk down somewhere in the slurry, I presume? You'll trawl through it yourselves? Delusional rubbish, of course. It's akin to finding a limpet in a landslide. Just because it's unlikely don't mean it ain't gonna try, you blowhard. Yeah, we got every right to give it a shot. What happened to the free market? Give it a shot, then. Perhaps the free market will simply provide, but I've enabled this farce long enough. I'll be taking the map. And Shellfish Corp's flagship salvage rig, the Dark Star. Oh, <laughs> not the Dark Star. <laughs> we'll begin its search immediately. <laughs> oh, God, no. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, that is a movie of John Carpenter's from when he was in college, I believe. Essentially, it's a bunch of space truckers that shoot nukes at planets because they're supposed to be demolished. But let's just say they're not great at their job. Feel free to meet us there if you wish to witness victory, small fry. Trash it all, there's no time to waste. Everyone to the docks at Flotsam Vale. Well, I don't know how much game is left, if that's the case. So I think I just have to carry on with it. So, stream is going long. Recording, however, is going to go ahead and be paused. And by that, I mean I'm going to make a cut, like, immediately after this loading screen. Wow.